Okay, on the go here. So I'm on my way home and I'm thinking that today is a good day to talk about density. You know, density is a simple concept that usually for some reason, science teachers, like me, we like to complicate a lot. Here's what we're gonna do. Because my drive home is short, we're gonna give, I'm gonna give you the short version, the sweet, short, uh, easy version, right? And then in the classroom, we'll go ahead and talk about the, the mo more complicated things about density. So here's the deal. Here's the bottom line. Here's the secret. There are two things, two main things that I want you to remember for now about density. Remember and learn. There's a lot more about density that we're gonna cover in class, but for now, these are the two main things only two important things. Did I mention two things? Number one, if you put something, anything, a solid, a liquid, anything, if you put something on water or in water and it floats, it stays above water, we say that that something is less dense than water. Forget about what that means. I don't know what that means, Mr. S. Forget about what that means. Just learn that if something floats in water, is less dense than water. However, if something sinks when you put it in water, if something sinks to the bottom of the container where you have that water, then that something is more dense than water. So if something floats, it's less dense than water. And if something sinks, it's more dense than water. Now, if it stays in the middle, like right smack in the middle of, of the water, with water on top of it and water below it, then the density is exactly the same as water. But don't worry about now, about that now. Just remember, if something sinks, it's more dense than water. If something floats, it's less than this, less dense than water. Float, less dense. Sink, more dense. Float, less dense. Uh, sink, more dense. Mm. Float, less dense. Sink, more dense. Mm. Float, less dense. Sink, more dense. Hey, what's up? I'm not crazy. It's just, I'm, I'm teaching, bro. So that's it. That's it. Uh, in class, in the classroom, we're gonna go and uh, we're gonna go ahead and understand why is it that that thing that is less dense than water is floating, and why is it that that thing that is more dense than water is sinking? Okay. It has to do with a whole lot of things that are really interesting and that you're gonna like. Um, but for now, remember, less than some water float, more dense than water sink. On the go with Mr. S. See ya.